Hey guys, it is Dwayne here from Dewey HQ, and today we are continuing on with some more Cyber Sleuth. Um, so it's been a while since I've played this because I uh, pretty much spent the majority of last week working on the Persona 5 FAQ video. If you haven't seen that yet, be sure to go and check it out, um, whether after, after this video or you want to pause this video, come back to it. Um, but yeah, it's, it's definitely worth uh, a watch. It's, um, it's especially for those... Um, those questions that got asked over and over again. I mainly made it in response to um, the Persona 5 subreddit. I'm not sure if any of you guys um, visit over there, but it just seemed like every week um, there was uh, someone posting a comment saying, um, which which Persona game should I play? Um, do I need to understand? Like, do I need to play the other games to understand the story? It was just like, just simple questions like that. And uh, just to see it recur every, I'd probably say every week, um, it just it kind of got a little bit over the top, so I thought maybe a, a, a six-minute video would be enough to um, enough for people who are really curious about the subject. Um, okay, so this is saying we need to talk to Mirai, 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 um, which is the Digi Lab expert. Oh my, have you wandered off? Oh, that's right. I had to go to the entrance to Eden. That's right. I remember now. Okay. But yeah, there's not long to go until um, Persona, which is um, I'm getting more and more excited by the day. So um, we should have, everyone should hopefully really enjoy it. It'd be awfully nice if my kids could work at a big company like Kamashira. Nile Corporation. Nile Corporation. That's the company that created to research the Eden Avatar system, isn't it? I think they were bought out by some big company a long time ago. They aren't around anymore. Better head back to the office. Oh, so that was the person we needed to speak to. Okay. Um, Alright. That was quick. Look out. Well, hello there, young assistant. Are you getting used to the work? Uh, getting used to working as a detective? What's that look on your face? You're looking at me like I'm not supposed to be here. Gochan, can you tell me? Can you tell Gochan? Oh my God, Gochan can tell you why I'm here. Uh, well, something has happened. We can't find the Nile Corporation case files. I thought I'd ask someone directly involved in the case itself. Of course you couldn't find them. All the files are stored together at Kamashiro. At Kamashiro. I'm ashamed to have admit this, but we had to leave the files there. Exclamation mark? So, question mark? Oh my god. A little bit tired today, to be honest. Um, this was that hunch of yours, wasn't it? Yes. At the time, we had suspicions that Kamashiro had required Nile Corporation illicitly. And your father and I were investigating the problem when we investigating when we ran into a little problem. A problem. Pressure came down from up top. We were forced to abandon the case. At the time, we were also forced to hand over all ca case files to Kamashiro. So buy out. So Kamashiro pulled some strings. This uh, that was a self-incriminating move, wasn't it? That was implied. The, that was the implied understanding. Since we knew how bad it was, we decided to keep s silent track of where the case files were stored. I kept track even after your past father passed away. Uh, the files are being stored deep within the Avalon server, which is the main Kamishiro server. I'm sure it's part of Kamish Ka uh, cyberspace Kamishiro employees call the confidential database. And when I say I've kept track of it, it's not like I'm, I've confirmed the data, oh my god, the data's location first hand. At best, it's conjecture, conjecture based on info from scans on the environs. Call it my institute. Call it my intuition. God. 
Hmm, that's good enough for me. Well then, I say it's about time we have had them return what they've been keeping for us. Listen to me, Kyo-chan. This is Kamashiro we're dealing with. What are we going to do? How are we going to get around this top-notch security of a well-renowned company? Yeah. Let's learn from the case of the robbing of the robbing rooster. We don't use force to get through a closed gate. Instead, we employ strategy and have them open it for us. Well, hey now, is that even possible? A good detective makes the impossible possible. What? We've already had a rooster lined up. Someone who can crow just in just the way we need. We'll get her to help us when it comes to infiltrating Kamashiro. Ah, speak of the devil. Begging your pardon? Exclamation mark. He he he. <laughs> it's just like he he he. It's just like super serious. Um, once again, you've arrived right on time. This is my client, Yuko Kamashiro. Um, has there been any po progress? Yuko Kamashiro. Does that mean this is the president's for former president's I see. No one would question her if she was to walk into the corporate HQ. What? I... Who, who's this? Young lady, we need your assistance, please. Huh? What? Exclamation mark, exclamation mark, exclamation mark? What? Huh? What? Man, I never sit down. I've just noticed that. I see. So what do you say? We really need your help with the investigation. That's fine. I want to know if, any suspicion, if my suspicions are correct as well. Aha. Uh -huh. But I'm a minor, and it's such, and my authority within the company is rather restricted. I doubt I'll be able to do much and get them more than get you into the main lobby of the office. Let me think about this. If I was inviting friends for, uh, from school to take a tour, it shouldn't be an issue getting you in the lobby, I think. It'll be hard passing me and Kyo-chan as your friends. Worst case, they might recognize us too. Hmm. So long as you can get my assistant in, that'd be terrific. Can you manage that? But then, how do we get into the confidential database? Do we have any means of doing that? Exclamation mark? Even if your assistant were a world-class hacker, I doubt it's even possible. Ellipses. A slab of sleuth can make the impossible possible. Ellipses. Well, there you have it, Yuko. Leave the domain of the cyber sleuthing to us. Ellipses. Very well. I'll go and get things set up. What are you actually going to do, Kyo-chan? To get in? I have an idea, actually. Uh -huh. There was this one case where I got my hands on a little program. I'm thinking of having it customized for my assistant with the help of someone I know. Shall we get started with the preparations? My dear assistants, start by heading to Mirei Mikagura's place. I'll let her know that you're coming and why, and you can get the details from her. The ellipses. Okay, let's head on over to the Digilab. My preparations are complete. Go ahead and take this program. Exclamation mark. You got the hacking skill Stealth Hide. Oh uh, no. It's hacking skills program repurpose for the Baku program that Kyoko gave me. By using this, you're almost perfectly. You'll almost you'll be able to almost perfectly mask your account information. Effectively, you'll be invisible. Given your half cyber body, you should be able to use that skill not only in cyberspace but also in the real world. This skill could potentially be used for a wide variety of crimes, <laughs> but given your deepening bond with Digimon, I trust you won't use it for evil purposes. <laughs> it's like, mm hmm, really? Uh, that was rhetorical, dear. I see all. Okay. You're a cyber sleuth now. Someday you must expose my secrets. 
I got in touch with the Kyoko. Hmm, things went well, it seems. I'm sure you have many questions. Start by focusing on the relevant case. I heard from Yuko Kamashiro that you have been invited to the Kamashiro Corporate HQ. You got the Kamashiro HQ visit special visit URL. Access this URL to access an account with privileges to tour the corporate office. See, that's what's really weird about this, because we can tour an office in cyberspace. So does that mean like there's going to be like VR tours, but like it's in cyberspace? Like VR, like I imagine like a VR tour would be just like a camera with a 360 thing on like on, on a dolly if you know what I mean and then like get, getting pushed through a um a tour um the the privileges are limited to the lobby but sure enough you should be able to get in much more with more trouble without too much trouble we've had our rooster crew announced to set the fox loose inside the hen house you've gotten some handy hacking skills I know but you'll need to think on your feet in there be the wolf in sheep's clothing. It'll take all your cunning, skill, bravery to sneak on and waltz out with the grand prize. And for the record, Detective Matayoshi isn't involved with obtaining or using hacking skills for this case. Keep, in, keep that in mind. Uh, now let's get this job done. Anyway, better use the URL. Okay, leave the Digilab. Let's row. Okay, so I'm gonna go back in the office. I'm gonna go in here. No. Kamashiro Enterprises. You're so late. I got exhausted just worrying for you. You're so late. I got ultra super worried. Oh. Not that I was worried about you, see? Don't get the wrong idea or anything. I'm doing. I need you to pretend that you're my friend here. <laughs> Just follow my lead. So she puts on a sunder. Um. Sunder. Um. Bloody. Personality. Is there uh, anything the matter with that? You can pretend to be my friend, right? A school friend? A normal friend friend? Hmm, that's odd. Were the files I dug up on friendship mistaken? You want me to act like I normally do? I'm not sure I get what you're saying. If that's true, you and I are already friends after a fashion, no? Oh, I see. That was just a joke that fell flat, right? That was part of the plan, right, Dewey? Things got a little bit too real for me there. I forgot to let myself play along. What I mean is you've done your homework and I seem to have misjudged you. Okay. Anyway, welcome to Kamashiro. Let's pretend to tour the lobby. I'll pretend to show you around. Okay. What, you're going to strike out on your own? Well, what's your actual plan for getting in? What? How does a person just vanish, both the avatar and the account info? Oh, my, Miss Yoko. Yuko, where has your friend gotten off to? What? My friend has, um... We were playing hide and seek. What? Hide and seek. Yeah, that's right. Is there some problem? Uh, no problem, per se. It's a perfect place to play hide and seek. It's so spacious. Uh, I suppose it is. Sure. Uh, there is certainly a lot of space here. By the way, I'm it. Well then, good luck, I guess. Thank you, I'm going to find my friend. Just you watch. That's the spirit. <laughs> well then, give it your best shot and say hello to your friend for me. He says hello. 
A program that seals an account. This would require a Digimon programming hacking skill, which is completely illegal. I'll point that. I'll point out. But you and did, but you and Kiko did say that cyber sleuthing was your area of expertise, so that is reassuring. When you're finished, meet me here, and we'll leave together. Please try not to take too long. There's only a limited a limit to time. How much we can pretend to play hide and seek. I'll see you later then. Kyoko told me to think on my feet. I don't see any connect jumps. I don't see any place to connect jump into. Let me look around. Okay. Stealth hide. Oh yeah. Oh, was a bad here. Dark Tyrannomon Metal. That avatar. What servers can it access? Avatars are just data. Can I connect jump into it? Sure. Lol. No. <laughs> oh. No. Alright, let's go this way. I haven't been into one of these for a while. Uh, sure, we'll go this way. This does not look like the right way, but there is a metal down here by the looks of it. An item. Okay, let's get this way. Alright, sweet. Battle. Okay. Boom. I can't believe they gave me a, a bit of experience for that. <laughs> yeah, I go this way. Oh, that's um, that's the one that digivolves into Gardamon, but it goes into Solomon first. I think it is. It's a little. All I know is that one's that one did evolves into Gatamon uh, at one point. Let's go this way. Uh, looks like this is pretty simple. Gobblemon. Oh, too easy. So once you log out. Hmm, hello. The confidential database should be around here somewhere. Let's keep moving. Okay. Go to Digilab real quick. Um, it's actually one. Oh, hang on. Damn it. I just realized my guys are on standby, so maybe I should actually get them to do something. Um, let's tell them to develop goods. I'll give them a thousand yen and they can develop goods. Oh wait, hang on. I think I need to change the leader to a builder. There we go. That only take 40 minutes. Um, Digivolve. Speaking of farm, um, Digimon, can I Digivolve any of them? Digimon. Yeah, let's, let's Digivolve me to this one. Okay. He looks pretty cool, I guess. Okay. Alright, so I think that might wrap it up for today, just because we're structured on the end of the episode here. Um, I try to keep them around at least 20 minutes each. 
Um, but it looks like we've got like this giant maze looking thing up here. So this looks like it'll be the next part. So the next car, uh, the next part should be up soon. So keep an eye out for that. It was Dwayne here from Dewey HQ and be sure to, um, subscribe if you were keep if you're interested in the series or just click out on the at the end of the video see you guys then